Good morning, my very first day at the Fashion Retail Academy. I am very, very excited. I am also feeling very nervous, but I'm sure that's normal. I'm sure everyone's feeling the nerves. Just arrived in London and we're on our way to the Fashion Retail Academy. My friend Angelica, we travel Hello. together to the academy. We've known each other for quite a while. We are currently on our lunch break. This morning we've been in the um, new building. Yeah, the second campus, which is on Charlotte Street. And this afternoon we're going to be going back to the main building. We learned quite a lot this morning. To be fair. All about the history of um, fashion retail, different jobs, and things like that. We really love the position of the Fashion Retail Academy. It's so close to like all the shops and all the food. Hi guys, my name is Molly. On my induction day, I was really nervous, as I'm sure a lot of people are. Yesterday went amazingly. I really felt like it was my place to be. Everyone's in the same boat and this is where I want to be. I met a few girls who are in my group, in my class. They're all really nice. Yesterday, I did manage to make a couple friends that were from my class. It's great that we all have this one thing in common, which is that we love fashion and we're here to study fashion. But you do just make friends quite easily. There's a whole support system for well-being. There's also learning support. You can speak to your tutor. I've had a few times where I've had little panic attacks or just days where I'm not feeling the best. I've ended up going to the well-being room and it's actually been really helpful. They've allowed me to have a break out of class and just chill and gather my thoughts. Yesterday I did also receive my first project. It was to create a mini magazine. We have five weeks to do this. This is my research folder. Then this is my research for the Get the Look page. Some primary research. Here's my double spread for the 60s page. So yeah, today I will just be getting stuck into doing that. Ready to go back into the college tomorrow. Officially my second week, my first week at the college. I don't think it could have gone better. We've yeah. just been given a template for our task for of our magazine. Today is Wednesday the 6th of October. My first month at the FRA has been incredible. I love it so much. I'm handing in my first project that I've completed. In class, we are the first with her. Of course it is due date, so we need to check all of our work. You've got to research your chosen artwork. We have been introduced to challenge week and basically we get one week to do a mini challenge. Today I have a very, very exciting day. We are putting together our artwork and there's going to be a photo shoot. And I had the best day in the world yesterday. It was, oh, I can't even, it was so fun. I loved doing that. We got to edit them, we got to pick all the clothes. We had only one day to plan and one day to actually do the photo shoot. Sometimes like in the industry, you'll have to do things like that. On the Fashion Retail Academy, I found this interview for a Dior intern. So I'm really excited with that. We're just on our break. We like to find a new coffee place every time for our break. An overview of my first term. I've learned so much already and I already know like what I think I want to do as a career in fashion. Like, we learn everything from health and safety in the retail stores to how to create a window display and it's just really interesting to learn about all of the different types of work that actually goes into things like that. Still can't really believe that I'm there. Um, I worked so hard to get there and it's just paid off. Morning, so it is the first day of term today. We are actually very excited to get on with this project because it's very creative and there is an upcoming trip. So our project is to create our own pop-up shop. So we were given three or four tasks to help with our research and sort of helping us sort of see what it's really like to be a visual merchandiser. The three tasks were to fold clothes into like a display on a table. 
And then the second task we did, we arranged all the clothing onto rails, almost like how it should look in a shop or in like a clothing bay. The last one we did was probably the most fun one, but also really tricky. I didn't realize how hard it was to dress a mannequin. So these tasks were really, really fun, really helped us realize what it's like to be a visual merchandise and some of the day-to-day -day tasks that you'd be asked to do. Hey guys, we're on a break. We're gonna rent out scooters. Are we actually there? <laughs> We're going to class. We got friendship rings. End of the day. It is Monday. Today it says we're going on a little trip um, to the Liberties store. We are here because we're doing research for floor plans so we can get inspiration for our um, pop up shop. We're actually making our boxes today. 30 by 15. Incisions. So I'm just catching up with some college work. We went on a trip around um, Selfridges to look at the window displays. I really liked this design. So this is what it looks like. I poked holes and put lights. Looks like this, which I think is quite cool. On the corner of the road where our college is, there's actually a shop that's always used for pop-up shops. We saw that it was actually a dog food pop-up shop. So we went in, there was loads of dogs. We took some photos for our research folders. Good morning and hello. It is the 1st of December today. Today my project is due. London is looking very Christmassy at the minute, very cute. This is my finished product um, of my whole project, which is due today. So today I'm pretty sure we're going to be having a challenge week, which was really exciting. I really, really enjoyed the last one. We've been the finishing touches so to our come up for challenge week. I'll show you everything Next, we have to create our website and social media. So we've got like a related hat and matches as well. Because this is obviously a competition, we wanted to do that the extra stuff, so we decided we wanted to do advertising on like taxis and buses as well. We've got very exciting news. We just had to present our Christmas collection. Then we have to pick a winner to um, go and present it to the actual Silk Red programming managers. And our group won! Hello! It's been the Christmas holidays, so I haven't been at college. I spent the holiday with friends and family, which was really lovely. I am really looking forward to going back and seeing all my friends. After a break, it is quite nerve-wracking to like go back to something. I always felt that in school, but to be honest, I felt really confident in college so far. This year, I've decided that I'm gonna work as much as possible. Happy New Year! So I came back to college after Christmas and honestly, I have been doing so much. I've had so many experiences, which I don't think I would have got if I went anywhere else. I was presented with the opportunity to go to Bista Village. I got to go there to do like research. We were mystery shoppers. We got given a chosen retailer to test out what the customer experience was like, what the products were like. One of the best field trips I've ever been on. So now I'm gonna move on to the project that um, I was given after Vista Village. It's called Project 3B, B is for big data. We were asked to look for the spring summer trends. This was a really fun task to do. This is also gonna help us create our collection. Now I'm gonna move on to my main deliverables folder, which is what we get given on the brief. These are the tasks that we have done. So this is my customer profile board, a product um, brand map. This is a comp shop analysis. This is a trend board, which is something that I learned new in this project. This is a spec sheet. I've learned so many new things. I'm excited to see what next month holds um, and I need to get on and create my collection. Last week before my whole project was due, the scary Super No Debt College. From the last task of our project, some of our friends from school came up from London to come and see us. Because um, obviously, the Fashion Retail Academy is located in such a good area of London where we can just go and explore everywhere and really take advantage of it. 
we're off to lunch. It's literally just across the road as well, which is really good because it's raining. <laughs> So I've actually finished my project, ready to hand in on Wednesday. The main objective for the project was to create our own capsule collection and this is what I created. I'm really happy with it, fingers crossed. Hi everyone, the project was basically designing a summer capsule collection for a brand. So I chose to do H&M, I used lots of bright colours and then after we got our project uploaded and everything, me and Ellie went out for dinner. I think it's really important to like treat yourself when you know that you've done something well. It is submission day today, but I am feeling really confident. I made everyone cookies. So this is the second half of this project. In the second half, we are actually creating a marketing pitch. I chose to do some advertising on buses. Here's my bus map. This is my website. I've been creating my packaging mockups, Instagram mockups, and more email mockups. It is the 23rd of March. I'm submitting the second half of this project. We are on our lunch time now, it's been a really busy morning getting our work finished. We're just walking down Oxford Street because it's really sunny, we've got to find something to eat. Done it! So that is that, another project finished. It's been so much more about learning what it's like in the real life and fashion industry. Morning. Day number two of challenge week. Second. Not hair extensions. We have a new girl in the class. <laughs> we have finished the whole PowerPoint for our challenge week and we're going to present to the class. I will show you what we've done so far. WDN is the brand that we are working with. So yeah, it's all based around mental health. This is my last week of college before we break up. It's a very miserable day today. One of my favourite things that we do um, in class, we always get to look at like the red carpet looks and do reviews on them. At the moment, we're doing the Oscars. So we have officially broken up from college, and I'm going on holiday with me. So I am actually home from holiday. I'm going to Cambridge with some of my friends from college. It's just really nice to know, like. Even outside of college, I, I will still see my friends. I only met them this year, and it's just really nice to know that I've really bonded with people in my class. I thought I'd show you the main things I take with me to college. Obviously, I bring my laptop. I have snacks and a drink cables and chargers, my airpods if you're in class um, teachers don't mind if you do have your airpods in if it helps you concentrate better i have my wallet that's something i recommend getting as well an oyster card if you can you get your tube prices a lot cheaper and then just some makeup we are at a new place for dinner. We're actually literally on the like the outskirts of Covent Garden. So many new places yeah. to try for food. Such an ideal location. We have finished our project proposal. What's really good is we've got like checkpoints to upload to make sure we're staying on track. We have a project action plan. This is what I'm going to be doing in each week. So I have such an exciting day ahead of me. We are going on a school trip to the VNA. It's going to be so good for my primary research, for my um, final major project, and it's just going to be really fun to go look around the exhibition. This is something that's really good about the FRA. You don't miss out on any help when choosing your next step. We did get a careers talk. Luckily, we have a really good careers team and you can book meetings in. They come to talk to you about universities, level fours that you can do at the FRA, BA honours that you can do at the FRA and apprenticeships. On Wednesday, we had a trip to the V&A Museum. We got it for free. Uh, usually it'd be like 20 pounds. It was so inspiring <clears throat> for my collection. 
this is my last week of my first year of college i'm really sad but also like i think this week's gonna be a good one as i can enjoy the nice weather at college but yeah let's go for my last week we're on lunch my last day oh i lost it yeah last college outfit it is no. submission day, no, so no, I no. am going to talk you through is my you project. Project. And this is my research and development. Very, it's a very important part of the project. This is my introduction, positioning map, comp shop and analysis, concept board and customer profile board is my range plan slash cable so i'm ready to upload i literally can't click the button i'm so scared college is out you're not gonna be seeing our faces anymore <laughs> Yeah, that's it. College is over and out. Bought myself a little little present. I can't believe it's over. Bye. Bye. Bye.